Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala descends to the lowest heavens when a third of the night is remaining. And he asks, is there anyone repenting that I can accept the repentance? Anyone? Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, to not forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanny Lungu, and on this channel, we post uh, reaction videos each and every day. So if you guys want us to react to something, let us know by dropping us a title, but a link would be better. So drop us a title or a link and we'll actually look into what you guys are suggesting and thank you and the big shout out to the people that are also giving us movies to watch in our free time thank you very much for educating us and we're just seeing things from a different point of view other than reactions we've got a second youtube channel called funny and jesse 2.0 where we post vlogs every week you guys can head there and enjoy the content that's there and just um don't forget to subscribe. We also have a podcast called Diving In with Fanny and Jesse. We're now on Spotify. You can find us on iTunes, and you can actually find us on this channel and our second YouTube channel. Second YouTube channel on here, we're going to post the audio, and on our second YouTube channel, we're going to post the visual of whatever we spoke about. So it's like a like two-in-one thing. You've got the video and you've got the audio. Whichever one you're comfortable with, head there and just watch it and like it of course uh we also have a patreon account funny and jesse you can feel free to become a member and we'll appreciate other than that you can find us on facebook and instagram as funny and jesse i write short poems and uh stories you can find me on wordpress as blue and you can also follow my personal instagram account called tafani l i post short poems there i also have a second upcoming uh blog called morning coffee with funny and and you can just feel free to follow all these accounts and enjoy the content that i'll be putting out there and the content that we're actually putting putting out there and for everything that i've said you can find a link in the description box and just feel free to click the link and for everything else that you want us to do make sure you let us know in the comment section below a big shout out to everyone that's been subscribing uh for the subscribers i'm even speechless i don't know what to say but we're very very thankful and grateful for you guys subscriptions a big shout out to the people that watch the people that comment the people that give us things to react to the people that interact with us the people that educate us and thank you very much thank you thank you thank you very much so as you can tell from the title i'll be reacting to allah ask this question every night a big shout out to the person that suggested this you're the best uh, and thank you very much so without wasting time let's get into the video i love you Allah. so my brothers and sisters i want to tell you something إن الله تعالى يبسط يده بالليل ليتوب مسيء النهار ويبسط يده بالنهار ليتوب مسيء الليل حتى تطلع الشمس من مغربها حديث authentic Allah says subhanahu wa ta'ala through the blessed lips of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa that Allah stretches the arm, Allah stretches his arm in order to forgive those who have committed sin by night during the day. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala stretches it again during the, the night in order to forgive those who have sinned during the day. Until the sun will rise from the other side, from the west. Do we seek forgiveness of Allah? Do we seek the forgiveness of Allah? There is another narration which we all know, I'm sure. يَنزِلُ اللَّهُ تَبَارَكَ وَتَعَالَى إِلَى السَّمَاءِ الدُّنْيَا كُلَّ لَيْلَةٍ حِينَ يَبَقَى ثُلُثُ اللَّيْلِ الْأَخِيرِ فَيَقُولُ هَلْ مِنْ تَائِبٍ فَأَتُوبَ عَلَيْهِ وَهَلْ مِنْ مُسْتَغْفِرٍ فَأَغْفِرَ لَهُ وَهَلْ مِنْ سَائِلٍ فَأُعْطِيَهُ a, a narration where the Prophet ﷺ says another authentic hadith. The Prophet ﷺ says Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala descends to the lowest heavens when a third of the night is remaining. And he asks, is there anyone repenting that I can accept the repentance? Anyone seeking forgiveness that I can forgive them? Anyone asking me anything that I can give them? Surely we should be seeking that forgiveness from Allah. Allah becomes very happy when we seek the forgiveness of Allah. And this is why I say, Everything we have with us is from the earth, it shall be left onto the earth. 
you came into this world with nothing. You shall leave with nothing besides your deeds. That's what you're going to take with you, your deeds. So if you would like the material items of this world, remember, no matter how much you have amassed of this worldly life, it will only give you back two square meters for you to be buried. That's all. It won't give you more than that. The shroud that you have, the two square meters, and you put in. That shroud is for respect. You are Banu Adam. You are a human being. You, you, you need that little bit of respect, subhanallah. So to honor you, you put in a shroud, and you are buried two square meters, subhanallah. And how much did you have? You could have had the billions. It meant nothing. You are going to leave everything behind. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless every one of us and grant us goodness. I hope and I pray that the words I've said would motivate us to seek forgiveness out of the love of Allah. We seek forgiveness out of the love of Allah and keep seeking forgiveness and never lose hope and believe and be convinced that inshallah by the will of Allah, we will achieve that forgiveness and Jannah is going to come to us solely and only by the mercy of Allah. Not by our deeds, but in order to achieve that mercy of Allah, we need one word. What is it? Try. Keep on trying. Keep on trying and never give up. Aqulu qawli hadha wa sallallahu wa sallam wa baraka ala nabina Muhammad. Keep on trying and never give up. Adjust the words that you want to hear when you wake up or just for motivation's sake. You can't be a perfectionist in life. You have to try. You just can't. How can I say this? I think, by the way, I love Muf Dimenk. I love his teachings and everything else. Not teachings or whatever. I just like whatever he says. Uh, try, try by every means. Each day we wake up and try. Let's not try to be perfect, but let's try to do things the godly way. Let's try to always remember to ask for forgiveness. Let's try to always run to God when we want something, be it we're asking for blessings or asking for forgiveness. Let it be from God. Let's not seek all these things, or rather, let's not. Uh, change and seek things from the world or earth or whatever you want to quit otherwise i enjoyed watching this a big shout out to the person that suggested this it was very very interesting if you guys have any contributions to this or narrations of this message by mufti mink uh, you can let us know in the comment section below otherwise i enjoyed watching this let me know if you enjoyed it as well and keep the suggestions coming or requests coming thank you very much make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video